Good morning students. Welcome to class 1 English language class. Today I am going to teach you general questions and answers. These questions answers are from your active English book. Let's start with the first question. Was it a holiday yesterday? So you will write yes it was a holiday yesterday. So after writing yes you will put a comma then you will write it was a holiday yesterday. These answers will be according to the question. So you have to just write yes it was a holiday yesterday. Clear? Next. Was it cold yesterday? So you will write no it was not cold yesterday. When you will write no you have to use not with it. Clear? So you will write no it was not cold Yesterday. The next question is Were you in school yesterday? So you have to write No, I was not in school yesterday. No, I was not in school. Yesterday. If the question is starting with were, then why are we using was here students? Because I is singular. So with singular you have to use was. So no, I was not in school yesterday. With no you will use not. Clear? Next. Were your friends in school last Thursday? You will write yes. For your friends you will use the pronoun they. Yes, they were in school last Thursday. They were in school last Thursday. Clear? Moving on to the next question that is Do you go to school by bus? So you will write yes I, you becomes I Go to school by bus Yes I Go to school By bus Clear? When the question starts with do, you don't have to make any changes. You just have to copy the question. Go to school by bus. Only you will become I. Clear? Next. Do you go to school on Sundays? Do you go to school on Sunday students? No. So you will write no. I do not go to school on Sundays. This you will become I. And with no you will add not. So you will write no, I do not go to school on Sundays. Clear? The next question is, did you eat an apple last night? So you have to write, yes, I ate an apple last night. Yes, I ate an apple last night. So what are we doing here? You is changing into I and this eat, you have to write the past form of eat. That is ate an apple last night. Whenever the question will begin with did, you have to change the verb into past tense. Clear students? So here did, so you will change it to ate. Ate 
is the past form of the verb eat. Clear? Next. Did you buy an aeroplane last week? You will write no. I did not buy. An aeroplane last week. Now students, you must be wondering that why in this ma'am has not changed by? Because in this answer you are writing with no. So when you are writing with no, you have to add did not. And when did comes in the answer, you don't have to change the verb into past tense. Because did itself is a past verb. Clear students? Yes. The next question is, does your teacher wear a hat? So you have to write, does your teacher wear a hat? No. So you will write, no, your becomes my teacher does not wear a hat. No, my teacher does not wear a hat. Whenever you are writing your answer with no, you have to add not. Clear? Next. Does your teacher teach you English? You will write, yes, my teacher teaches me English. Yes, my teacher teaches me English. Now here what we are doing is, this your is changing into my and whenever the question starts with does, you have to add S or ES to the verb. So what is the verb here? Teach. So you will add ES. It becomes teaches. You becomes me English. So you will write yes. My teacher teaches me English. Clear? Yes. Moving on to the next question. That is what are you going to do tomorrow? When the question has going to, your answer should also have going to. You will write, I am going to study tomorrow. I am going to study tomorrow. How you are framing this answer? What are you? So you becomes I and with I you use am. I am going to, you will take from the question and whatever you want to write here, you can write. I have written study. Study tomorrow. Clear? Next. What are you going, going to do tonight? What are you going to do tonight? So you will write, I am Going to sing tonight. Same thing. I am, this you becomes I am going to sing tonight. Here I have written sing, study. You can change anything. Whatever you feel like you can write. Clear? The next question is, what time do you have dinner? Here, you have to mention the time. So, you will write, I, you becomes I, I have dinner at 8 o'clock at night. I have dinner at 8 o'clock at night. Now, before the time, you have to add the preposition at and you will write at night because 
8 o'clock can be morning also. Clear? Next question. What time do you have breakfast? You will write, I have breakfast at 8 o'clock in the morning. Because you have your breakfast in the morning. I have breakfast at 8 o'clock in the morning. Clear? So what we studied today students? We studied the different question and answers starting with was, were, do, did, does etc. And I have explained you to answer the question both in yes and no. And what is the difference if you write your answer in yes or in no? Clear? So the worksheets related to these will be uploaded on your school website. Kindly go through them. That's all for today students. Thank you.